everybody. Guess what? <laughs> I finally finished my science project. I knew you could do it. To celebrate, Mom gave me a new toy. Hippity hello! I'm Bella Bunny Nose. Hi, I'm Doc McStuffins, and this <gasps> is the McStuffins Clinic. Am I dreaming? Nope, not dreaming. Unless we're all dreaming, which means we're talking in our sleep. You're not dreaming, sugar. Welcome to the clinic. Oh, my nosy noseness. I've always wanted to be a toy doctor. You mean you aren't already a doctor? You're dressed like a doctor. Oh, and your coat is beautiful, by the way. Oh, thanks. It's just I'm a new toy, so I don't know anything about being a doctor yet. You're in the right place to learn. This is our exam room where we do... I nosy no checkups! Wow! Look at all those tools and charts. Oh, there's so much to learn! Uh-oh. You okay, Bella? My tummy feels kind of funny. Sounds like it's time for your first checkup. Hmm. Your plush tummy feels a little clumpy. I have a diagnosis. Bunny hopping in with the big book of boobos. Bella, you have new toy tummyatosis. Your stuffing is all bunched up. Are you feeling nervous? Oh, yes, I am. Becoming a toy doctor is exciting, but it's all so new. Sometimes it feels like I have butterflies in my stomach when I'm doing something new. I just take a deep breath or get a hug from mom and dad to feel better for a new toy. All you need is a cuddle to soften your stuffing. <laughs> that does feel better. Do you think I'm ready to be a toy doctor? You can be my intern. <gasps> you train me to be a toy doctor? Oh, hippity hops! That's my dream. Welcome, Welcome Bella. Bella. The doc and her intern, Bella, are in. in. Intern Bella are in! Tools of the trade. I'm hopping to go, Doc. I'm ready to be your toy doctor intern. <laughs> Good, because I have a surprise for you. <gasps> this! It's so cool! Uh, what is it? It's a doctor's kit. Come on. Hippity hops! My very own toy! This is a stethoscope. I use it to listen to your heart or hear the whir of a winder-upper. This is an otoscope, the perfect tool for checking eyes and ears. How about bunny ears? <laughs> Those too. Oh, I nosy know that one. It's a thermometer, but I don't exactly know what it's used for. A thermometer is used to measure how hot or cold someone is. We've got a patient. Doc, Donny left me in the sandbox all morning. I'm gonna melt. Don't worry, Chili. Let's bring you in for a checkup. Which tool should we use first, Bella? Oh, I'd hop to the stethoscope first and listen to Chili's heart. It's beating fast. Huh, is that because Chili's upset? Right. We're all here for you. Thanks, Bella. Let's check your temperature with the thermometer. Hmm, Chili, your buttons are a little hot. What does it mean, Doc? When kids get too much sun, they get sunburned. That's why I wear sunscreen. If Chili gets too much sun, his buttons might fade. I have something for you, Chili. <laughs> this will keep your buttons cool. A sun hat for a snowman? Genius! Thanks, Doc. And I've got something for you, Bella. Your Cool Tools badge. Oh, my nosy noseness! My tools really came in handy today. Oh, I just can't wait to use them again. The Doc and her intern, Bella, are in! in. Check-in for a checkup. And this is Stuffy's chart from the time he got flat tail -itis. Oh, did I hear someone call for a brave, handsome dragon? <laughs> We're reviewing your chart so Bella can learn about caring for toys. I am the perfect patient. <laughs> <laughs> you are! 
You've been so healthy, you haven't hippity-hopped in to see Doc in a long time. Stuffy hasn't been in for his annual checkup? Of course I've been in for my animal checkup. <laughs> Not animal checkup, annual checkup. That's the checkup you need once a year, even when you're healthy. I think Bella should lead this one. Uh, you mean get a checkup right now? But I'm fine. Check out this dragon stomp. Uh, stomp, 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 stomp me. I think Stuffy might be a little nervous since he hasn't been to the doctor in a while. When I'm seeing patients, I always try to make them feel comfortable. Got it. I knows he know what to do. Stuffy, I've heard you're one of the bravest patients Doc's ever had. You can talk to me just like you talk to her. Really? Absolutely. I want you to be comfy so you can tell me how you're feeling. Should we hop to it? Let's do it! <laughs> time for your checkup, time for your checkup. Just gonna check your ears, check your eyes, find out how much you've grown. Time for your checkup. We're gonna listen to your heartbeat, fix you up, ready to go. Time for your checkup. It's okay if you giggle. This will only Stuffy, you are a perfectly healthy dragon. And you are one hippity hoppity intern. Thanks, Bella. Thank you. I learned so much more about caring for toys. And you've officially earned your checkup challenge badge. Wow. I'm one hop closer to becoming Dr. Bella Bunny Nose. And I nosey know you'll be great. It's a crease. Oh, Doc's back! Now I can finish my dragon juggling act. Sorry, Stuffy. We can't play. We've got a patient. Yes, Stuffy, we have a patient. Who is it, Doc? Oh, my arm! I'm sorry, Lammy. You were stuck in my bookshelf and got a crease. Don't worry. I can lend a helping paw. Should we do a checkup, Doc? Hallie, can you prep the exam room? I'm on it, Doc. No rips in your plush. No loose threads either. Doc, do you think it could be... I think so. Lammy, we have a diagnosis. You have bendy plush-itis. Your arm is creased, and that's why it keeps bending back. Oh, oh this is bad. How am I supposed to dance? Or cuddle? Uh oh Lammy needs to cuddle. Can you help her, Doc? Of course. Hmm. <gasps> I know, Zeno! As a toy bunny, I have wire in my ears so they can flop or stick up straight. See? <laughs> That's cuter than a kitten cuddling a canary. <laughs> what if we use something stiff to hold Lammy's arm in place? Great thinking, Bella. We can make a splint. I had to do something like this when I sprained my pinky finger. It works for kids and toys. With a little time in a splint, Lammy's crease will uncrease, and then she can take it off. Right, Doc? Exactly. Oh, thank you, Doc. And Bella. But can I cuddle in the meantime? <laughs> sure. It's a miracle! I for cuddles! Oh. Excellent work, Bella. Here's your cuddling care first aid badge. And a cuddle for you, too. Aww. <laughs> the doc and her intern, Bella, are in! A dragon's tail. <laughs> Your turn to kick the ball, Stuffy. <laughs> Whoops. What if I... Hiya! Woohoo! Did you see that? I did, but now I can't look. How far did it go? Never mind that. Look at your tail. Huh. Oh. Let's get you in for a checkup. Yep, it's a case of squish squash tail syndrome, all right. What can we do to help? Hold the end of Stuffy's tail. I'll take the top. We have to press and push. Does that put Stuffy stuffing back in place? Exactly. <laughs> <gasps> we did it! <laughs> now I know he know how to treat squish squash tail. And now I can get back to Dragon Ball. 
I was able to hit the ball a lot farther before. Maybe the stuffing inside your tail needs to work its way down. <sighs> I guess that means back to the checkup table. <gasps> Wait, I know, Zeno! What if Stuffy keeps playing? As he hits the ball, his stuffing will move farther down in his tail. Great thinking, Bella. Exercises can help you become stronger after an injury. It's called physical therapy. So I don't have to go back to the clinic? Nope. Just keep playing. Like this. <laughs> hey, my tail feels better already. This dragon is ready to stomp. Great work, Bella. <gasps> A helping paw toy therapy badge? Tiffany hops! I sure learned a lot from you today. That's what a toy internship <laughs> is all about. <laughs> the doc and her intern, Bella, are in! Emergency Bella. The treasure is inside the castle. But it's guarded by a squeaky fish monster! No! Oh, not a squeaky fish monster! <laughs> Chili, it's only squeakers. Well, step aside, squeaky fish monster. Uh, squeakers, you're supposed to be a squeaky fish monster. Oh, no. Squeakers must have hopped on this rock and got a rip. We need to take you to the clinic, Stat. What? Stat, Doc? That means right away. We've got a toy emergency. <laughs> Don't worry, Squeakers. We're right here with you. Hmm. Let's see. Lateral fish wound. Patient sounds whistly and whooshy. What do you think our diagnosis could be, Bella? It looks like fishy teritis. Correct. We'll need to do an emergency patch repair. I know you know it's scary, but this patch won't hurt a bit. There. Squeakers, I think your fishy teritis is cured. Can you give us a squeak? Ah, hip hop hooray! I'm glad you're feeling better. And I'm glad you were here today, Bella. You did the most important thing in an emergency, helping your patient feel safe and calm. You've earned your Keep Em Calm badge. Hippity hops! I'll always be ready to hop to it in an emergency. Welcome, Squeakers. The Doc and her intern, Bella, are in! Sticky Bunny. Morning, everybody. Happy hello, Doc! I've had my bunny nose buried in the big book of boo-boos all night. I never nosy knew that water toys could have too much water in them. Oh, yeah. Happens to me all the time. <laughs> Chili, you're not a water toy. Yeah, you're a plush toy, like Bella. Hey, nice star. What star? Oh, pretty. Oh, but it's stuck. Oh, ah, and sticky. Oh, ouchie. Let's take you in for a checkup. Bella, you have sticky, icky star stuckitis. A sticker is caught on your plush. Let's stick that in the big book of boo-boos. We haven't uh, covered this in uh, my training yet. We have to unstick the sticker from your plush. It might take a while. One time I got paste in my hair when I was doing crafts and it got all tangly. It took some time to get out. Uh, I don't want to be some bunny on the checkup table today. I want to help patients and learn something new. Here's your toy medicine lesson for today. It's important to take care of yourself so you're healthy enough to take care of others. Kick back those bunny feet, sugar. We're here for you today. Ah, this is nice. Now I nosy know what you mean, Doc. Your sticker is almost unstuck. In the meantime, take a look at this. My Take Care of Me badge! <gasps> there. You're right! I did learn something today. One of the most important lessons of all. Huh. The Doc and her intern Bella are in! Green Snowman. 
Chili, but Bella is right. We need to treat your green snowies first. The green clay is almost gone. Oh, thanks, snow globes. There, your green snowies are officially cured. This means that Chili is clear to cuddle, right, Doc? <laughs> right. But it's important to wash our hands so we don't spread germs. If Chili would have cuddled Lammy with green hands, Lammy might have gotten green on her too. <gasps> That would have been bad. Pink is more my color. Thanks for looking out for me, Bella. Hippity happy to cuddle away. Oh, come here, Chili. <laughs> oh, so nice. Every doctor knows how important it is to wash your hands. So today, you've earned your Scrub and Sparkle Clean Hands badge. Thanks for lending a hand today, Bella. Here's to clean hands. First surgery. Oh, oh. oh, Sparkles, I'm so nervous. You got this, Bella. Doc has taught you everything you need to know. Oh, it's just my first toy surgery is a bunny big deal. There's nothing to worry about. Robot Ray needs a switch replaced all the time. Oh, yeah, me too. <laughs> Chili, you don't have a switch, just stuffing. But can I practice with you? It would be my pleasure. Okay, click and twist. Click and twist. <sighs> Robot Ray is prepped for surgery. Ready, Bella? Oh, sparkles! Bella is so prepared. <laughs> and Chili is so sparkly. Oh, what's that on my snow belly? <gasps> oh, my nosy noseness! It's the sparkles from my bunny nose. Oh, Doc, I'm so nervous. My nose won't stop wiggling. Maybe I'm not ready to do surgery. Well, what's so bad about a few sparkles? I think they're beautiful. They are. But we can't have Bella's sparkles falling into Robot Ray's switch compartment during surgery. Oh, I guess I won't be doing my first surgery today. You just need some surgery gear, like this. Doctors wear masks and caps so they don't share germs. You can wear these so your sparkles don't get on anyone. Hey, looking good! How do you feel now? Like a real toy surgeon. I nosy know I can do this. Don't forget this. <gasps> and this. The Shining Star Surgeon Badge? Robot Ray is an excellent pause. Thanks, Doc. Let's hop to it. <laughs> the Doc and her intern, Bella, are in. Graduation. Buttons. Buttons. Blocks. Blocks. Oh, ouchies. Ouchies. Huh. What kind of spare part is that? Something pricklier than a porcupine just poked me. Oh, it hurts. I nosy know an emergency when I see one, but Doc's not here. Then I nosy know a toy intern when I see one. Bella, I need you. Doc showed me how to take lots of x-rays. Let's see what's under your plush. What is it? Don't tell me. No, tell me. Never mind. I gotta know. You were poked by a dress-up daisy earring. I nosy know the diagnosis. It's pocatosis. I'll need my tweezers to pull it out. <laughs> there. Hey, everybody. Everything okay? Bella treated Holly's pocatosis. 
great tweezer work, Bella. How are you feeling, Hallie? I'm one healthy hippo, thanks to Bella. You mean Dr. Bella. <gasps> you did it, you did it, you did it, woo! You worked hard, we're so proud of you. You did it, you did it, I did it! Woo, woo, woo! You made it, you graduated, time to celebrate. Believed it, then achieved it, let's stand. Incredible intern badge. Congratulations on graduating from your internship. Dr. Bunny Nose, from the bottom of my hoppity heart. Thank you, Doc. Now I'm the bunny I meant to be. <laughs> <laughs> Graduation. But 